Hi, I'm Devin Barringer. Thank you for coming to my YouTube channel. I'd be happy to answer a couple of questions that I commonly receive about hypnosis. In order to understand hypnosis, we have to understand that there are two aspects to our mind, the conscious mind and the subconscious mind. Now the conscious mind is our current experience. Uh, right now your conscious mind is listening to the words that I'm saying or actually the sounds that I'm saying and interpreting them into words which assign meaning. It's also looking at my, my face for visual cues. It's understanding what's happening right now. Now your subconscious mind is doing everything else. It's evaluating your blood pressure. It's evaluating your pulse rate, the temperature of the room, processing past memories, doing all these things of which we're not aware but that are vital uh, to our daily existence. Now hypnosis is the means by which we bypass that conscious mind and impart suggestions or ideas directly into that subconscious mind. And whatever the mind can think, the body tries to prove. Let me give you an example. I want you to imagine, really imagine, that you're holding a lemon. In your mind, see yourself looking at this lemon. It's bright yellow, it's got a waxy surface. Look at all the dimples on the skin. If it helps to close your eyes, go right ahead. Just imagine you holding that lemon. Feel the weight in your hand. In fact, why don't you bring it up and, and just pretend to smell that lemon and you might catch a, a fragrant smell of citrus. Imagine now that in your other hand you're holding a knife and you slice gently into that lemon. You can see the, the juice just kind of spray into the air and as you cut into that flesh, it begins to run down your hands, that, that sticky sweet juice and you can smell that citrusy smell. Once you've cut that lemon in half, I want you to give it a little squeeze and see the juice beat up on it. Now bring it up to your mouth and take a great big bite. Now if you're like most people, you actually started to salivate. There is no lemon. The lemon is entirely in your mind, but it was such a powerful image that your body attempted to make it real. And so you had a physiological change. You began to salivate. Uh, the blood flow began to, to happen differently in order to prepare you to eat that lemon, that imaginary lemon. That's how hypnosis works. We can impart suggestions or ideas directly into that subconscious. And whatever that subconscious believes, the body will prove it true. So if we tell your subconscious that, for example, you dislike the taste of cigarettes, your body will no longer crave that taste of cigarettes. If we impart a suggestion for entertainment purposes that your hand is stuck to a table, your body will make it so. Your mind will believe that to the point where your body will actually make it feel like your hand is stuck to a table and try as you might, you will not get that hand off that table. Well, the truth is, hypnosis is a normal, natural function of our daily life. We all experience it on almost a daily basis. For example, perhaps you're driving to work and you, uh, you're thinking about your day. You've done this drive hundreds of times and you get to the office and you get out of the car and you think, I don't remember driving to work. I don't remember if I ran a red light, if I stopped at a stop sign, if I used my, my turn signal. You don't remember. What happened there was your conscious mind was thinking about something else and your subconscious mind did the drive for you. Now, of course, you stopped at the stop signs and you, you obeyed all the traffic laws because your subconscious mind is smart. It's done that drive. It knows what to do. But your conscious awareness was elsewhere. That's hypnosis. That's exactly what it feels like. It doesn't feel strange. It just feels like you were thinking about something else. You were daydreaming. And even up on stage, when we do stage hypnosis, that's what it feels like. You don't feel any different. You just feel like you are relaxed and, and whatever suggestions I give you, they're just easy to go along with. And so you go along with them.